What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of The Walking Dead with your favorite awkward, socially awkward guy. Me. Okay, so we on episode three, Above the Law. Shocking development, developments drive a wedge between brothers and arms. Man, oh, I forgot old girl name. <clears throat> but she gonna fuck around. And she the she the wedge between them two brothers. Previously on The Walking Dead. Let's just see how this one turn out. You not fill his cup up anymore, baby. Remember, <clears throat> he's sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. Solamente está confundido. Mama. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hey! Put your hands up and close your eyes. Thanks. Oh, Sorry. shit. Now we're drinking coffee. Oh, shit. Kate. Javi, don't. Hey, what do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Holy shit. <clears throat> I regret nothing. What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little, in front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it, and that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day for food and water and gas for the stove. Oh, am I babbling? I babble when I'm scared. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. I know. It's just hard to get used to. That's all. We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. Powwow. There it is. Let's take it and go. Why would we get that lucky? Hey, keep it down. I know it sucks, Kate, but you gotta watch out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. Oh, shit, find him. Keith, you're a hammer! 
her now! Oh god. That's. One of Gabe's friends. True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. Okay. So you recognized him. That's no reason to let it kill you. And it was going to kill you. I know. I know you're right. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people. If they're just the dead. Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were going to die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just going to wake up and we would just be gone. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. <sighs> Can we go back now? She's still trying to push up on her. She been doing this shit from the beginning. I think due to my past failed relationships, the reason why I'm trying my hardest not to let him fall for it. I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back. But it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there. For an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. Somewhere not so isolated. So, we'll leave. Go somewhere else. Somewhere safer. Somewhere with crazy thick walls, okay? And a gate that's 20 feet tall. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. And if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cape. We're safe inside the house. We're tired of being afraid. Every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now. While we still can. But what about Dad? What's he going to think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We have to look out for ourselves now, Gabe. I wish things were different, but our safety is more important. But we're safe here. No, we're not. I'm sorry, Gabe, but Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe, honey. What? What's what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? She's sad. Because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew. But it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean he, he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Now. Tomorrow. As soon as it's daylight. I want to leave I'll, uh, I'll help you get started. Okay? What are we going to tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Tell him we'll find him. Somehow. We're all going to see each other again. 
Yeah. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really. in between that give you look cake in between Javi and his brothers because I know how this shit go. Everything ain't green on the other side all the time. And she could probably be thinking this that Javi is what she want, but hell she's already married. Like literally, you made your choice already. And you a stepmother to these two kids, and what a one kid now. I don't know man, we gotta see how this we gotta see how this go. If she gone here and if she open up and express herself and make it known what she want, then well she kinda making it known what she want, but it just sound like a booty call. Dad? Javi, is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. I can't fucking believe this. It's, I mean, it's you. Couldn't have said it better myself. I knew you were still alive. I knew it. Hey, weapons down. This is my family. You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. We got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. She's coming inside! But she hasn't been checked! This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No! I didn't say that! Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. Don't you get it? I'm David's brother. I'm going to the hospital with them. We have procedures here. Procedures that have to be followed. Even if you are related to David. Ah, this is bullshit. Come on. The sooner you come along, the sooner we can get you cleared. I'll be there as soon as I can. Let's go. Mm, I don't like this. It's amazing what one cup of coffee do for your mood. Trip. Oh God, Eleanor. When we found the car without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. 
Well, luckily we found her before she got any worse. They just took her to the hospital. I can't believe no one went to look for her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond. Their new frontier. Oh my god. Oh, ho, ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Hobby, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Hobby. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it... I hate to admit it, but... There's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen... It... It's possible. What was he like when you knew? You guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. At least at first. If you want to hear me say he's an asshole, fine. He's the biggest asshole I know. Question is, is he a big enough asshole to go along with some of the shit they've done? Yeah. If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. I'm not just going to let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Okay. Come on already. Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. Thought I taught you better than that. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip. Just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll put in a good word for you, okay? See if we can't hurry the process along a bit. Thanks. Interesting or reader. I'm still a kitchen angel numbers. And I need some more coffee. One second, John.
Coffee is early as hell. Doesn't sound good. Like post some in the morning. I we mean, no process. Like Our morning. own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. Of course not. We're happy to be here. It's good to see you alive, brother. Same here. Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe, he told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? I don't know what to tell you, David. She was too sweet for this fucked up world. You gotta have grit to get this far. Yeah. How, how did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate too. Oh, Ask God. your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Mm-hmm. Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Bastards knocked me out and threw me in their truck. I got away near this town, Prescott. The same assholes attacked us there. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. I can be impressive when I try. I'll follow your lead. Just don't get cute. <laughs> I run security here. It's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Oh, this shit. Is fresh meat. Ava, this is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. 
My brother talked about me. All the time, at the start. All good, I hope. <laughs> I think you know the answer to that. <laughs> Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. She kind of bad. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Where the hell is Clementine? Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you for three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. You but you mean... were taking care of them, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. The day Dad died, I promised I'd stick around. Be there for the family. Oh? Well, can't my word. Took the end of the world, but you finally grew up. <laughs> Damn, this is where the treating Porsche, Kate. I haven't Porsche Don't the get comfortable. David. We're not staying long. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi. I'm glad you're okay. Hey, I was gonna say the same about you. It's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. I'm pretty sure you have to say that. Doesn't make it not true. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die. Everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. Yeah, I know what you mean. This place gives me the creeps. <sighs> I'm glad to hear that. I was afraid you'd been won over by the security here. No. Nah, it's always been you and me that. on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. Okay, so. I'm thinking I'm about to go with the question of what about David? Because they to steal your husband and it seems like... <sighs> I'm, I'm probably overthinking it. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I hear you, Kate. But we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. She was rambling a bit. 
Yeah, I, I think she's delirious. Well, she seems cogent now. But it's nothing to be alarmed about. Pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. Hmm. I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. How are you? Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can vouch for the rest of them too, right? It doesn't work that way. But we'll make the case for them soon. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good carry. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Okay, so we got two on our side. Remember what I said. <laughs> when we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. Bit. So they've been together for three years on their own. They basically left and thought, assumed they were dead off back. So, I guess it'll be okay. If, I mean, it is the end of the world, but I'm just, I'm just trying to find the, the good pal. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> Oh, yeah, the cell you threw me in was totally five-star. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi, take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden, or a baked delicacy by yours truly. Everything looks so good, I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. <laughs> Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's uh, word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so, yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. I always do what I'm told. Ask my older brother. You're gonna fit in well, Javi. I can see that already. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good <laughs> run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. That looks pretty intense. Doesn't it hurt? It's burned into your flesh. Of course it fucking hurts. It's a sign of commitment, not a Buddhist symbol from your year abroad. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... 
We lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. But I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Max, what are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. It better be the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. He shot Rufus. In the back. You did what? We found the body near the wreck of Rufus's truck. You cold cocked me with your pistol. I woke up in a truck with cable ties on my wrists. That don't make it right. Rufus the was fuck bringing you mean you it don't make it right. We wasn't gonna hurt you. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to killers. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say? Ooh. I want to say something. I want to say something. David told me not to say nothing. No. That's it. That's right. He knows what he done. There ain't nothing more to say. Uh, it's clear your brother doesn't belong here. Javi and his people have to go. You're overreacting. It was a scuffle over supplies. Uh, we've exiled people for less. Sorry, David. Your soldiers are already wild enough. We can't add more crazy to the mix. Take Javi and everyone in quarantine to the gate. Give them a pack with a bare minimum to survive. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you... You're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. This is ridiculous. You have to do something. I... I can't right now. But maybe I can down the road. Mm. Just stay alive. Okay? That just infuriated me. That dude over there. That, that dude gotta go. I can't wait to get him. You're lucky I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? David packed this. He did. They said- Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. 
God damn it, Harvey! Stop! You're gonna get us killed! Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. The fuck? Kate. She knocked you on your ass. Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. We trusted you. What the hell, man? Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have <laughs> shot us more than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. Oh, damn it. Oh, yeah. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. There's Richmond. That helps. But we can't go back there. Well, knowing where it is lets us know where we are. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. And if this is us here, then I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. And to find north, we need to find the North Star. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. Let's go. Trip, come on. What's up? I can't lose anyone else. I'm telling you. I can't. Prescott, Conrad, maybe Eleanor. Knock that shit off, Trip. You're better than that. <laughs> we'll see. <sighs> Sorry, man. Rough day, to say the least. I know you got my back, and I got yours. Of course. I'm good. After you. You're a real one, true. I gotta tell you, man, I thought you and Kate were, you know, I wouldn't have guessed she was married to not you. I ain't judging, mind you, I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't my business, I know, but what have we got to lose out here? I... Hey, man, it's all right. Go for it. I do have feelings for her. And maybe I shouldn't, but that doesn't just make him go away. Uh, no harm in saying it. Hell, only real harm's in not saying it when you should. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. <laughs> if they're Boy. one and the same or otherwise. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just when you think you got everything figured out. And yeah, you're right, goddamn mess. And it never quite washes out. 
I know Eleanor told you that she and I were whatever we were, but that's over now. I respect her wishes. I really do. Damn. I just wish my heart respected mine. Jesus got his eye on something. <laughs> what you got for us, man? The iron. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. We better scoot. People, I got it. Well, Jesus, cold as fuck. I hate we even tired you up. Piece of this? Careful with this. <laughs> We're even now. Really? I thought you were getting out of here. I was. But the walkers are everywhere. I had to cover myself in walker guts to get away. Come on. We're heading to a factory nearby. Should be safe. I thought you were going to Richmond. New Frontier kick you out? Doesn't surprise me. Not one bit. Not all of us. Kate and Gabe are still there. With David. David? That asshole's still around? This is gonna sound really weird, but... He's my brother. What? Wait. This place we're going? David sent you there? It's supposed to be safe. Clem. You can't trust him, Javi. I learned that the hard way. Mm -hmm. This brand is a lie. It's a lie that says you can trust us. You belong. They don't care about their people. They promised they'd help him. But they were gonna let him die. What the hell is AJ? I forgot all about him. <laughs> Ava and I were in this unit together back in the army, and uh, believe it or not, I know you the medicine you need, AJ. I don't care what they say. <laughs> Huh? Really? Yeah, <laughs> 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 
Just like that little guy. I mean, she's she's amazing. I would I would fuck with her. Right. <laughs> Venison. <laughs> Hope I don't have to use that. <laughs> River Oxpan. Oh, I don't think this is it. Diffle Prox. Not that one. Let's hope we ain't got to use the needle. Here it is. It would have to be a shot. Oh, shit. Clown. Dr. Lingard, what's the matter with you? I'm... I'm fine. Clem, please don't. The vancomycin. That's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. I told you. It could save someone's life if used right. It's too valuable to throw away. It's the only thing that can save him. Except it can't. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I... I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. <clears throat> Clem, put the drugs back My before heart. anyone finds out you took them. You know what they do to thieves here. I have to try. Look, AJ, a bunny rabbit. <laughs> AJ, shh. What the hell is this? I told her it was a bad idea. You fucking high again? Pull yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. How could you be so stupid? You stopped trying to help. I couldn't just sit here and watch AJ die. We stopped because he was a lost cause. That waste, that'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough. We should have left him out in the woods a week ago. But look, it's helping. It doesn't work that way, Clem. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. I wish I could tell you it would save him. Then it was worth it. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Without a goddamn thought for anyone else. We opened our arms to you, made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. Technically, she did. You broke <clears throat> our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. I made the right call. One you refused to make. Well, I'm making one now. Get your shit and get out. Maybe we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Come on, AJ. We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. Can't take him with you. That ship has sailed. Get out of my fucking way. Right now. Clem, he's in no condition to travel. Let him go, Clem. He'll only drag you down out there. No! no! You monsters! What about this? What was it all for? Don't forget, 
I'm one of you. Not anymore. Let her say goodbye. We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Oh, hell. Say what you need to say, then you go. Please don't make me regret this. I should have spit in his fucking face. I love you, Goofball. I love you. Come on, Clem. Not because that's the scene to cover. This but is what the game circled on the map. I just don't think he's dead. Our smelly friends are back. Push against this, it might give. Gotta find a way in. Here they come. I can. Fuck! I can raise it a little, but I don't know, something's wrong with it. Jammed or some shit. Maybe we can force it open. We're gonna have to. Well, there's a car with no wheels. Shit! God damn it! Fuck, well, we have to. Close. <sighs> Hopefully that door holds him. Who the fuck hey, is it? I'm here. David. 
Don't you dare let that fucking baby killer in. <gasps> Don't make me do this. Clem. Don't do it, Javi. Hey, open up. He'll die. He deserves worse. He has a son, Clem. Just like you did. The fuck? Open it. Bro. What the hell are you doing here? Ask your brother. She's trouble. Trust me. How could you do that to Clem? God, what if it had been Mariana or Gabe? What did she say? That you left her to die. No, we kicked her out. A little girl, all alone out there. Do you think Mariana could have survived that? We had rules. Clem broke them. I would have done the same to anybody. She knew what would happen. Don't feel sorry for her. To anybody, huh? You broke the rules for Kate and Gabe. And I'll accept the consequences. Unlike her. Did he suffer? Please. I have to know. Tell him. No. I wouldn't have let him. But I didn't have to worry about that. He lived, Clem. So she was right. He lived. But how? He was dying. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. It was... a miracle. You're lying. I don't know, Clem. I don't think he'd lie about this. You don't know him like I do. Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's in Richmond? Dr. Lingard took care of the boy. He'll know how to find him. Then I'm going back. None of us are going anywhere until the walker's clear. True. What's your plan, David? We used to store vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. Wait. This is a send-off? You're, you're just seeing me on my merry way. You think I want this? Well, you're not doing much to stop it. I don't see another way. Shit! Board it up. We need something to buffer. Something heavy. There! Help me! Come on. Wait a half second. Where'd you find this? Over there. Show me. Hmm. What the hell is all this? These could come in handy. Don't want to just take them, but... I might be going crazy, but I think these came from Prescott. That's Phantom Punch. I don't understand how all this got here. Like you don't know. Hey, none of this stuff was here before. I don't have a damn thing to do with it. We've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts, for emergencies. Your people looted this stuff from Prescott, David. Come on, we can't know that. Who else knew about this place? Your outfit is the only one that gutted my town. This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns I heard got raided a while back. 
There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. <laughs> Take cover. Fuck him. I'd do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? You only just realizing that now? I told you. Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. That shit is the new gold. And now we get to see your head pop, you piece of shit. David? Mm -hmm. I thought better of you, Max. I really did. Mm -hmm. David, come on, man. We're a okay. unit. There's no need for... <laughs> Stop him! He's getting away! Oh no, you no. don't. Get Badger! Nah, you ain't getting away from me. Baseball. Huh? Wait, what just happened? What just happened? Come on, come here. that easy. Ooh. Come on. Get up, Harvey. You're just joking. You're not gonna fly my way. If I'd have known you were Dave's brother, I'd have shoved that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. But this will do. Nice try. Bitch. Fucking Garcias. Oh, you, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. I'm, I'm, Fuck. This is for Mariana. She was a sweet little girl, just minding her own business. <laughs> Not anymore. Oh, hell no. Fuck her. And fuck you, too. Yeah, let's do it all in nitty gritty fashion way. Get it over with. I couldn't have said Come it by myself. What are you waiting for? We've got to move. Fuck. Whoa. You killed Mariana. You killed Mariana. That's enough, man. He's gone. For God's sake, Hoggy! No. Get a of yourself! Well, I hope that made you feel better. Yep. Oh. 
He's all yours. Stop. Please. Raiding, looting, you betrayed who we are. You betrayed Richmond. Come on, David. This is Richmond. What's that supposed to mean? What's that supposed to mean? I ain't got nothing to say. Start talking, or I promise you, you're gonna scream. Okay, okay, take it easy. I'm waiting. Come on, man. It wasn't like we were doing this by ourselves. Joan was in on it. We did it on her orders. She... she said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm... I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. Please, don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. I don't I'll don't. i help you get back inside. We don't need your help. I'm begging you! I'm not playing with nobody. Where's Lonnie? He gave us the slip. Hightailed it back towards Richmond. Son of a bitch. If he warns Joan. What about the other two? Dead. Oh. What? It's good riddance. That son of a bitch killed Mariana. Did that make you feel better? I wouldn't shed any tears if I were you. He damn right it did. Bastard deserved everything he got. Be careful, Javi. Act like a beast. You risk what makes you human. Don't become the thing you hate. You weren't there. You don't know what Javi went through. Emotions aren't picky. They get the better of all of us eventually. Sometimes there's just no other way to make things right. My friend took a crowbar to someone once. My people need to know about what we found here. What about your missing friends? I'm surprised you care. Human life isn't exactly high on your list of priorities. Don't have time to keep looking. They'd want me to get home and warn them. So that's what I'm gonna do. Sooner the better. You sure you won't stay? We need your help. So do others. I won't forget about you. You have my word. It's a shitstorm out there, man. I don't see how you're gonna make it. One step at a time. We need to get back to Richmond fast. I have loved ones in there. We both do. We all do. Oh, yeah. I gotta break Eleanor out of there. Once she's safe, I... I'm gonna tell her how I feel. Hey, if the mess never washes out, might as well get neck deep. We're gonna <laughs> need allies in Richmond. Lingard and Clint, they're our best bet. If I can get to them before Joan does, maybe we have a chance. I know I was ready to say goodbye before, but I can't do this without you. Can I count on you? I won't be able to pull this off myself. Fine, but I expect first-class treatment when we're done. No more quarantine for me or my friends. Just the red fucking carpet. Of course, whatever you need. Let's just get this done. If Lonnie raises the alarm, they'll be waiting for us at the gates. There's a way in round back that'll get us around any sentries. We can take Badger's truck. I doubt he'll mind. <laughs> we gotta get on the move. <laughs> Herd's closing in. Uh, no, you did not. <laughs> Just make a funny. <laughs> Sure, he won't mind. <laughs> I'm sure he won't mind. <laughs> you no, know, Badger ain't thinking about much these days. Then the sign behind me said, Brain. Oh, thinking this will go a lot better if we split up. A group this big can't exactly sneak around. 
Particularly if they're expecting us. Eleanor's in there somewhere. I'm going after her. Lingard brought her to the clinic. That's your best bet. Javi, that's where you'll go to get Kate and Gabe. Then bring them to my house. It's the one with the raven on the hitching post. We'll all meet up there. After I pay a little visit to Joan. Stay out of sight. They'll be keeping an eye out for us. As soon as I can get Kate and Gabe, we'll see you back at the house. Roger that. I'll scout ahead. What about you, Clem? I'm pretty sure I've still got some friends in the New Frontier. If they know where AJ's being held, they'll tell me. As soon as I find him, I'm taking that truck and getting the hell out of here. Well, you are owed a vehicle. Hmm. Keep an eye on David. He may be playing nice, but I'd still watch your back. I'm with you, Clem. He rubs me the wrong way. As soon as I get Kate and Gabe, I'm gonna figure out what's best for us. Well, I hope it involves getting far away from here. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe <coughs> he's not the man I think he is. See you when I see you. David said to hang a ride up at that corner. Seems clear so far. Let's move. Let's ride. You know Javi Garcia? Used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? That's who we're looking for? Yeah. That Javier Garcia. Anyway, sounds like some paranoid horse shit. Guy's a fucking ball player. There's the medical center. Gonna go ninjas way back in here and stir up trouble. We go yeah, in, we get L, we get Kate and Gabe, though. we get out. All right. What about our friends there? Doesn't exactly look like a welcoming committee. All right. Let's hang out here for a while. Smoke break. Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? Hmm. What the fuck? Shit, we need to get the fire crew or that shit could burn down the block. You couldn't have just taken out a window. Did the trick, didn't it? <laughs> Hell yeah. Find Elle. Tell her we have to move, Kate. You got it. I'll meet you here. Super worried. Like, a lot. Are you guys okay? They didn't hurt you, did they? No. We're fine. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? Javi! There's no time to explain now. Let's get to safety first. Oh, okay. David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay there. Then let's go. Wait, Javi? While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. I felt like she was sizing me up. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble. Like he was no longer in charge. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but it only made me worry more. Joan's been running this place behind David's back. She's pulling the strings. 
What do you mean? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. We found all this stuff from Prescott. She was behind Prescott? Yep. David's rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you wanted to try it here, but this isn't our fight. We already lost Mari because of these people. Now, the whole place is about to become a war zone. The only thing I care about is keeping you safe. Then you know we can't get involved. What's going on? Tripp said we had to move to David's house. We're not doing that. We're getting the fuck out of Richmond before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? W what about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe, we don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But he won't know where we are. Again! I can't go... <sighs> decisions, decisions, decisions. Let's see. Do we go with Kate's plan or David's plan? Let's go with Kate's plan. I want to get them to safe. Back to how things were before. I'm sorry. I just can't. I'm sorry, Gabe. But we have to get out of here. If we're leaving, I've got to get some things for the road. All my stuff is stashed in the room they gave me. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds good. Gabe, come help. I got it. Come on, buddy. I'm not going, Javi. What? I'm gonna find my dad. I have to. Gabe, please don't do this. I'm sorry. I love you, Uncle Javi, but this is something I have to do. <coughs> Gabe. No. Kate. No. Please, Gabe. Please. I never thought I could be a mom. I never thought I wanted to be a mom. Until I met you and your sister. I'm begging you. Don't do this. It's my dad, Kate. I can't lose him again. And I can't lose you. Gabe. Kate, we need to go. Now. Look at me, Gabe. Please. He made his decision. Can't do nothing but respect it now. Be a man, I thought. It's his father, Kate. It's what he wants. And this is what you want. What we want. We got so close in the last few years. I... I thought Gabe would want to stay with us. I really saw him as my kid. I guess he didn't feel the same way. He's growing up fast, Kate. We have to trust him to do what's right. I know. It's just hard to say goodbye. I 
I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. I'd talk fast. Fast and clear. Could you please point those somewhere else? That's him, right? The brother? Thought so. Bring him in. Kate! Run! I don't like your tone, David. If this is about your brother... Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. You've got a lot to answer for. Me? You must be joking. What's this? They were trying to leave. Him and his lady friend. Leave? I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe, not tuck your tail and run. Were you really gonna desert me when I needed you most? I'm sorry, David. We thought it was for the best. Great. Good to know you've got my back. Where are they now? Girl got away. No sign of the kid. We'll deal with this later. And despite what we <clears throat> all agreed, you smuggled your brother back into Richmond. What happened to you, David? It hurts me to see you betray your own people. You've got some damn nerve. We used to be so close. Oh, you're one to talk. If anyone betrayed Richmond, it's you, Joan. What are you people talking about? So this is your play? You think you can pin this mess on me? What mess? Would someone please explain what's going on? I can. Lonnie? Go ahead, Lonnie. Tell us. They attacked us. Murdered Max and Badger. You son of a bitch. They would have got me too. But I was lucky. Are you kidding me? You have the nerve to accuse us? Their bodies are in the factory. See for yourself. Why don't you tell them what you were doing up there, Lonnie? Tell them how Joan ordered you to kill and loot. Is that true, Joan? <laughs> it's nothing but a smoke screen. A pretty damn transparent one, if you ask me. Lonnie, please tell me this isn't true. We did that. Raided those communities. Hurt those people. <clears throat> because David told us to. What? Not Joan. I'm sorry, David. I can't do this anymore. I can't hurt anyone else. This is wrong. I am asking you, please, tell them the truth. This is bullshit. He's covering for Joan. David, just stop. We knew this couldn't last forever. We confronted him. Me, Badger, and Max. We were done. We let him know. He said he didn't need us anymore. Not with his brother here now. That's when he... That's when Badger and Mac... That's enough! David, stop! Paul, you have to stop her. Or the blood from those raids, it's on your hands. Don't let Joan get away with this. Paul! She's working you like a puppet, man. Can't you see that? Don't let yourself get played into doing something you regret. Maybe we should sleep on this. Give everyone some time to cool down. No. Don't try and drag him into your mess. The things you've done, they're an assault on what we built here. You and your brother, you're going to have to answer for them. I still have friends here. Allies. This won't stand. You brought this on yourself, David. I'm sorry to say it, but... You're done here. They were our family, David. How could you? You blind piece of shit. I'll give you family! Oh, shit.
Bro. Bro. <clears throat> this that 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 was that that was something. I don't even know what to say. I legitimately don't even too much know what to say. Boy, episode three was lit. <laughs> Damn. I'm pretty sure I probably fucked up a lot. A lot of scenarios, but the way the story going right now, man, cuz. Ooh. Sheesh. To think I was about to go ahead and end it early. I'm glad I played this one all the way through. Shit. I wonder if, uh, I don't, I still don't know how to feel about David. Uh, I hope he ain't dead. If he did, then that gives us a chance with Kate. But, damn. I might end up replaying this whole game. But that episode deserves some fucking likes, some shares, some comments, especially. Y'all, please. For the sake of the episode and how lit it was. Like it. Because the episode was lit. When we get to the next episode. <laughs> y'all better make sure y'all got your smacks, your smokes, your, your whatever you need. I don't care. Just make sure you get it. And I will catch y'all in the next video. Peace out.